New at noon, Tennessee death row inmate Edmund Zagorski is now on death watch. He was convicted of murdering two men back in April of 1983. Death watch is the three day period before an execution when strict guidelines are put into place to maintain security and control of the inmate and the prison. The state will use the electric chair for the first time in 11 years when Zagorski is executed Thursday. Earlier this month, he chose to die that way instead of by lethal injection. A federal judge now says Tennessee cannot execute Zagorski unless his lawyer gets a phone during the final minutes of his life. The judge's order says the state must allow Zagorski's lawyer to have immediate access to a telephone during the time preceding and during the execution. State attorneys fought against the request, but Zagorski's attorney says it is vital so she can alert a judge if something goes wrong. Another inmate on death row is scheduled to die before the end of the year. David Miller's execution is set for December 11th. He killed a woman with disabilities in South Knoxville with a fire poker and knife in 1981. Miller has been on death row longer than any other inmate in Tennessee. If you want to read more about Zagorski and Miller's cases or to find out about the other East Tennesseans on death row, go to WBIR.com. There we also have details on electric chair protocol scheduled to be used Thursday on Zagorski.